go. Again. First thing, you see time of what time it is. Okay, I think I should win because I played a very uh, honest game, but yet still made alliances that helped me out, but they didn't drag me along, like I wasn't just hanging on the coattails. I also did some work, so honestly, I was just honest and played a competitive game, which is exactly what I wanted to do, and I'm in the top two. Uh, I think I was... I should win because I feel like I was uh, pretty respectful to all of you. Maybe a little offensive, but definitely respectful. <laughs> and that uh, I felt like I played a pretty honest game and uh, didn't stab too many people in the back. Maybe there's, I'll be honest, maybe there's like one or two. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, one or two. But other than that, I was, I was pretty good to my word. And uh, yeah. Um, I guess to both of you, how come you deserve the tuition? Why, what, what makes you need the money? Uh, so that I don't have to take out student loans again next semester. I take out loans to pay for tuition this semester. Uh, it'd be nice not to have to do that next semester so I can not be in as much debt. That's the same exact thing. If you're talking about like deserving, it's hard to say who deserves it more, but I'm paying for college all by myself and the money would help a lot. After you win, if you have any extra, a little bit of extra cash from the prize money, what would you buy with it, other than tuition or books? To let you know, it's not cash. It goes straight into your account, but hypothetically. Hypothetically, if I got the cash money, I'd definitely be buying some Oakleys, probably about eight pairs of them. And uh, I'd use it for gas money to travel home, and for travel, because I really like to travel, I'd probably go to New York or Vegas or something like that. Where's home? Home is Kearney, Nebraska. Yeah, yeah, Carney. I don't know what I would spend on it. Like, it needs to go to the my school. But if I had to pick, um, maybe go back to California and get some real surfing lessons. So what you guys are saying is you wouldn't donate any to charity? No, no, I wouldn't donate any to charity uh, unless unless you count charity as you know putting some towards my college fund so I don't become an evil dictator and take over the world. I mean, that, that's about the best charity we got right here. Oh, I would agree with the not giving it to charity part, but not the other part. <laughs> I would be a little greedy and just keep it all for myself. If you were a type of pizza, what would you be? I'd be the hangover helper from Toppers. It's got a little bit of everything and it likes to help people. I'd be pepperoni because I love the taste and it's really simple. Uh, when you had four people left, describe your thought processes that you went through when you figured out who was going home and who was staying for the final three. The thought process was that it was already thought out by the time we got to the final four as to who was going home. It was a matter of not, hopefully not letting the other person found, find out they did and then trying to cover up our tracks. I was on the fence because Rancher's such a great guy and he came up and talked to me and I knew I was pretty much guaranteed the final three because me and Logan were close and Logan had Rafiki pretty much tied in. So I told Rancher that the only way that he could go into the final three was if he won that last challenge and he didn't and I told him that I'd think about it but I thought about it all night. There's no way that I could just keep him around and not take Rafiki or Logan to the end because there's nothing on Rancher. There's no like dirt on him. Logan's won something before, and Rafiki wasn't as much as a threat. It, was, it didn't seem like he tried as much. Do you guys have any regrets as to how you did or did not play this game? I I think I regret 
maybe not coming in as physically fit here and then you know like pushing myself running around this area and like you know I can't really feel this muscle or these muscles um but I I don't know it's like it's hypocritical of me to say that I regret hurting people but I do because like I said like you guys became my friends and it was it was a lot harder to do than it is to say right now I mean there were multiple times that I mean, even when all three of us got back on the bus, I mean, it was a depressing scene for about 45 minutes. You're, you're, we were playing our game of golf, we get there and like the tears almost came out, bro. I'm, I don't know. If I, if I regret anything, it's, it'd probably be that as hypocritical as it is, just hurting people who became my friends, you know, hurting them and stuff. It sucks that I had to take toe off because I really like her or whatever. Sex with Rancher too, but I kind of wanted it to work out like that because you have to think of who the other two people you're going to be competing with is so you can try to see if you can get people's votes. And there's just too many strong people out there that could win. So, First of all, I just want to say thanks to everyone, especially KFRX, for this uh, opportunity. It was awesome. No, really, though, it was awesome. I met a lot of friends that... I can honestly, if I see him in, on campus, I'll say hi to him from now on. Even though it's a game and may, some people's feelings got hurt or whatever, like, it's a game. Like, they played it the best, they're here, that's why they're here. So, don't, don't be hurt by it. They played the game and they want the money. So, I, I have friends, I'll say hi to everybody if I run into them, so. Do either of you guys plan on coming back next year? I plan on coming back next year. I'll definitely sign up. I don't know how long I'll last. It depends if the people next year like watch the last season. But I mean, it can't, you can't be mad at the people that came back this year because why wouldn't you try to compete for free money? So I would definitely sign up and see what happens. And if I get voted off first, then it's because I won last year. Or you know, no, like whatever. You know what I mean. It's time to vote. Guys, I'm just really proud of you all. Just wanted you to know that. Seriously, thanks to all of you for coming out and participating. Vote number one is for Senorita. Number two, Senorita. Senorita, that's three votes, Senorita. Zero for Rafiki. Senorita. One for Rafiki knows the way. Senorita. Senorita. Rafiki. Senorita. We have a winner of Tuition Mission 2012. Congratulations to Senorita. Congratulations to you. You are our second place winner. You're not going home empty handed either. Let's hear it for our final two and our final three. After a vote, we found out Senorita is our 2012 Woo! winner. Senorita, I know it's like super overwhelming, super emotional. Is there anything that you want to say? I know you're probably feeling happy, but other than that, what are you thinking? Very excited, a lot less stress because I'm like a penny pincher, so it's really nerve wracking to think of college. So, helps a lot, a lot less stress, even though there's still stress about classes, but helps a lot. 